Well, the New York Islanders beat the Toronto Maple Leafs 4-1 on Saturday night, and that is one parting gift I would pretty much like to exchange for a win, at least if I were Brian Burke or Ron Wilson. Uh, but unfortunately, when it comes to those kind of things, you can't get a refund. The Leafs played very well Saturday night, and Ian White got his first goal. The Leafs uh, pounded Lundqvist with shots on net. In fact, we even outshot the Rangers. Uh, well, I can't remember what the shot count was, but... Joey McDonald, I think, reminds me a lot of Andrew Raycroft. He can play well, but he's inconsistent. And right now, the Leafs don't need an inconsistent goaltender. Um, he had a 14-26-6 record against the New York Islanders, um, which is not very good. And he played very well with the Toronto Marlies. I mean, I was at the home opener October 4th, and he played very well against the Hamilton Bulldogs. But when it comes to the NHL, uh, a starting goaltender position in the NHL does not cut it for McDonald. Now, the Toronto Maple Leafs are going on a road trip starting out west uh, in Vancouver starting next Saturday. Then they play Anaheim, Dallas, and Buffalo and end their road trip on Halloween by getting revenge against the Montreal Canadiens. Well, at least that's what I think they will. I mean, <laughs> look at it this way. Habs suck. And looks like so do the Vancouver Canucks. I mean... Luongo pretty much is getting off to one of his worst starts that a lot of hockey fans have seen. So I think the Toronto Maple Leafs can take advantage of this very easily by beating Luongo and beating the Canucks. I'm predicting maybe a 7-2 win uh, for the Leafs over the Canucks. Um, because I'm guessing that Andrew Raycroft will be in net uh, at least once Luongo is pulled in the third. So I'm very optimistic that the Leafs will get at least one win. Well, actually, I'm optimistic that we'll get all five wins on this road trip. So and I know what you guys are thinking. I'm crazy. But, heck, I'm a very passionate Leaf fan who believes the Leafs will make the playoffs this year. And, heck, I'm going to say the Leafs will win the Stanley Cup. Yes, I get made fun of or put down because of that. But, hey... That's the kind of passionate Leaf fan I am. So, until next week, go Leafs, go! Go Leafs, go! And stay positive, guys. I mean, we can make it, despite the losses that we've suffered so far. I mean, if there's one thing that Nate Palm Vermont have told us in their videos, is that we gotta stay positive, and we gotta think positive, and I think we also have to stop booing the Leaf players on the ice when we're losing at home. And I would like to see the Leafs improve on their home record because I don't think people would want to pay $200 and get their Leafs jerseys on just to go down to the Air Canada Center to see the Leafs lose. So we gotta start producing more home wins for the fans, guys. So until next Saturday or next Sunday, Go Leafs, go! Go Leafs, go! Go Leafs, go!